Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I am Stephen from CPFI. Today I'm showing you new things. The freezing tunnels established in our factory as a sample machine. And it's behind me, as you can see. So we're gonna go inside and have a look how the construction is like and how is the material we use. All right, now we're here inside the sample machine area. Okay. And CBFI spiral freezer. Okay. So this one is a sample machine that is established in our factory. And you can see the details. Uh, we begin from this side. Okay. Now this is the refrigeration unit of the freezing tunnels. Okay. This is the refrigeration unit. We're using the school compressor from Hambell Company. Okay. You can see the model number. Okay. This is how everything is constructed. Okay, the pipes has been welded as a complete one so when customer come they can see how the cables and pipes are connected uh, to the machine okay and let's see from this side okay we're using the this one oil separator high efficient oil separator okay the tubes it's a sample area this is the entry tunnels okay of all the all the goods we put the fish and put the shrimps in this uh, net so it will convey inside uh, slowly turn the bits is no problem and we can do that for you and this one is a uh, openable and we have a tray underneath so when you put the fruits uh, put the foot inside uh, on the on the net so some little fractions coming down so this tray will uh, collect those little fractions so you can remove when you clean the machine Okay, this one as well. And this one is the water outlet. Okay, so when you clean the clean the core room inside, the water goes out from uh, go out from this hole. Okay, we have one here and another one in the other side. Okay, so let's continue, move forward. And here we have, okay, this one, when customer, uh, the foot comes out in under minus 18 degrees, then it will be coated with uh, uh, ice water, okay? We put the flick ice in here, okay? So the water is icy. We put the ice cold on the surface of the fruit and then slowly go inside, go back to the, uh, another freezing tunnels so we can dry the surface of the of the watery of the watery food so it can have the ice cold solidite on the surface of the we can go inside the tunnels and have a check uh, all the structures and things Okay, this is the inside. It's a double spiral model. Okay, I'm already inside. So you can see we have one uh, spinning spiral here. And the other one is there. Okay, and this is the fan. Okay, air blast fan. And this is the, the wind blocker, okay? So the wind will not uh, blow the cold room board directly. So 
the coron bolt will be more durable. Okay. So we go to some more details, and this is the engines. This is the engines of the uh, reducer. Okay. Cables and the lights are well sorted in an organized manner. And you can see the floors. We're using uh, stainless steel and the full weldings. You can see the whole lines is full weldings. You can see the weldings of our machine. Okay, the welding is nice. Okay, let's go out and see the other side. So this one is a small one. We can also open and have a look. So this one basically dry the, uh, the surface of the fruit with the, with the water coating. Okay, you can see the, the air is blowing from above. Uh, to the chain bells below so the, the shrimps and fish with the water coating they go through here and the coat becomes solid so it will uh, seal the food completely okay this one is the fan and the refrigeration unit is coming from above okay coming from above so you can also see uh, the structure inside Okay, this one is the other side of the spiral freezer. You can see all the details of the construction. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all for today's uh, introductions. I hope you have a clear idea of everything. Our technology and also the material we use on the spiral freezer. So if you have uh, any questions about the, the projects or you want to add the spiral freezer equipment in your company, you're welcome to send us your inquiry.